What's been happening? You know, uh, I don't know, stuff? No, I don't know. Well, what's been happening with you? Uh, thanks. It's been... It's... It's anyone's guess. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. You were out of the city? Sure, you guys were gone, so I thought I'd, you know... Let's maybe not pretend it was anything to do with us. Those beast Hispanic dudes with automatic weapons and blacked-out windows. They kind of made me think it was an involuntary exodus. Yeah. Okay. That'll work. There they are, outside. Oh, caffeine. Come on. Your curling has been sluggish for weeks. A little bit less lifestyle guru and a little... Uh, excuse me, I'm trying to write a screen... Shush, here. woman! Hey, Amanda. Fabian. Michael. Hi, Mom. Hi, Jimmy. These two, a pick shop. Tracy's meant to be at the tattoo parlor. Tracy's getting another tattoo. No, oh God, no. That Laszlo guy's there. Laszlo? That asshole? What's he want? It's Tracy that wants something. She wants to get back on fame or shame after you and Uncle T cut her cameo short. Well, maybe we ought to help her out with that. Maybe we ought to. Hey, let me ask you. Back there with your mom. That went okay, didn't it? Anything that ends with Fabian's burst eardrum is more than okay with me. I, I mean, with... Me and your mom. I think it's an important first step in, like, the direction of okay, if you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. For something hip that you know, you're not gonna get me a Prince Albert, are you? Yeah. Oh, are you popping a fucking tent over here, you fucking psycho? I'm bu ah, you made me a pouty fucking hipster. Ah, oh. Ah, ow. Oh, ho, ho, that looks pretty. Here, let's. If I knew I was getting this much work done, I would have brought a camera crew. <sighs> this is gonna make my man tits look enormous. I, uh... Uh, look, are you gonna tell me what you're drawing, or, or is it a surprise? Uh... I said I needed security. <sighs> Should I draw his three pubic hairs? Ah, uh... there we go. Oh, nice. Uh, you got like a camera phone or a mirror? I can oh, yeah, I'll get you a mirror. Smash you over the head with it. That's uh, 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 snip, snip. Oh, this is a real one-stop shop. Look, we can work this out. Like men, you know, if you catch my drift. Oh, no, that's my, that's my signature, my ponytail. Now I got to get extensions. No, what you got to get is my daughter, whatever she wants. Yeah, without sucking on your piddle stick. Look, okay guys. Who knew you could use a tattoo gun? It's one of those skills you pick up in prison. You know, inking your name on your celly's ass. Ew, are you serious? Come on. No. Not quite. He's a fine therapist and a brilliant mind. He overcharges and underprescribes. Hey, I can attest to that. The charging part. He wouldn't even give Marisa anxiety medicine when she was having panic attacks. She was having panic attacks because she blasts yay all weekend. What are you, the cops? Yeah, what the fuck? I raise a rat boy? What? You gonna fit me with some concrete boots now? Just give me your size. I'm not judging. I mean... 
who am I to judge, right? All I'm saying is that Mr. Shrinkage might have seen through the sister's skeezy-ass friends. Uh, at least I got friends. Is that what you call them? Hey, hey, hey! Friendly, all right? Jimmy's only friendly through a headset and a haze of hot smoke. If that's as personal as he gets, I fucking ain't worried. Why are you ganging up on me? Because you're an easy target. It'd be hard to miss. Oh, I didn't mean it like that, that you're fat. I just meant you're not fat. I meant you're, you know. Nice one, Dad. Pick on our insecurities on the way to therapy. Hey, I just got it wrong. Actually, screw both of you. You're only here because I decided to get us back together. Hell, what are we? A 90s boy band? For the record, I was about to come see you, Dad. Sure you were. And Mom was about to serenade this drunken oaf from outside his bedroom window. Does little Jimmy Wimmy feel neglected? Oh, maybe Jimmy Wimmy should tell the doctor man about his horrible childhood. Wah. Hey, Jim, I'm grateful. Someone That's needed it. to do it. And you were the bigger man. I mean, not Thank that. Thank you, That's little it. brother. You're not an absolutely, completely useless set. You're a good kid, Jim. Does that mean I can have a car? Michael, kids, let's go inside. Okay. I'm fighting. Amanda. Hello. Good to see you again, Michael. I'm so glad. Here's a... So, will you drive us home? You know, there was a moment there, I thought... What? I don't know, like, maybe we still had a ways to go. You know, like, maybe we need more time. Time for what? Time to move beyond screaming at each other. That was cathartic. Catharsis all over my face. Ooh, I got a warm, fuzzy feeling. Probably just the meds you raided. Okay. Cathartic. All right, I just don't want it to be more of the same. Now you're the one making the demands? No, 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 not demands. I, I, I'm saying you're right. Something was broke, and we gotta work at fixing it. We do. All of us. Yes, Mom. For real, peeps. Because I started to understand something in there. No one else gets this family. Not Dr. Friedlander, or my yoga teacher, or our tennis coach, or the juice guy, or the dog walker. Oh, or... hey, hey. Oh. Or Jimmy's third grade teacher. Or the trash guy. Or dad's proctologist. Or the guy that thinks he's Jesus on Vespucci Beach. Or the hippie bum who thinks the world is ending. We're stuck with each other. I mean, how do you explain faking our deaths, changing our names, all the lying to the FIB? That monster Trevor. There's no explaining Uncle T. Hey, is he coming to the next therapy session? What? No. No. Jeez. Just one thing, Michael. Don't get us killed. And don't get killed. Can you do that? I'll give it my best shot. With every fiber of my being, I will do... Kids? Rooms. Last one standing. Again. 